let's start with the use case diagram for the parking lot. Uh, let's start by reading the question. Okay. So we would be writing down the metadata also along the side so that we don't miss it. Okay. Parking lot should have multiple entrances and exits. Okay. This is one. So uh, I believe this is also metadata. So I would write it on the side that parking lot is composed of entrances, exits. A global display board should display or should show the number of free parking spot of all types. Okay. So this global display board also, the parking lot should have different types of parking spots. Here we get, okay, mini compact and large. Great. So it has parking spots also, which are mini compact and large uh, that allow parking for motorbikes, cars and trucks respectively. Okay. So bike, car and for large, we have trucks. Okay, great. I think admin should be our first actor, so to say. So admin add slash remove entrances and exits. Great. This is one. A parking attendant should be able to create parking tickets. So there would be second actor parking attendant. Parking attendant create parking tickets. And let's go ahead. Parking lot should support different parking strategies. Okay. So parking lot is also having different strategies. Parking lot should support different modes of payment also. Okay. So let's say they have different modes of payment also at the end. Okay. So looking at all of it, I believe system should also be there as an actor who should be able to generate a ticket, right? Or who should be able to update the count of the display board because it's mentioned in the second point, a global display board should show the number of free parking spot of all types, right? So I believe system should also be there which would be generating ticket, updating the counts. Yeah, I guess that is it. So let's read below. Please provide a detailed low level design for a parking lot system that can handle the above requirements. Okay. You should consider how parking lot will handle incoming and outgoing vehicles, track parking spots, generate and process parking tickets. Okay. So generating ticket is there, right? We have put it and manage payments. Okay. So it manage payments also. So we forgot. So manage payments. System would be managing payment also. Additionally, you should consider how system will communicate with display board and handle different parking strategies. Okay. I believe updating display board is one thing and we forgot about parking strategies. So handle parking strategies. Okay. So I believe we are pretty much done with the use case diagram. We can use all of it to create class diagram, right? Parking lot is composed of entrances, exits, global display board, parking spots. Right. So here, if you see, I believe there should be composition relation because if there is no parking lot, there shouldn't be no entrance existence, right? Entrance cannot exist without a parking lot. Same goes for exit cannot exist. Global display board cannot exist. If they would have been able to exist, then there would have been an aggregation relationship between them, but they cannot exist. So I would say a composition relationship. So a parking lot is composed of entrances, exits, global display board and parking spots. This is one inference which I make take out from all of it, all of this metadata which I've put aside, right? Other than that, I think we have pretty much talked about the actors. Let's use all of it to create class diagram in the next lesson. So I'll see you in the next lesson. Thank you.